What's up, everybody? Welcome to Quarantine Day 7, where we're talking about why Wednesdays. Basically, what we're talking about is uh, the end goal in our investment career, the why we're doing what we're doing, whether it be in stocks, real estate, etc. What is the reason why you're going to work every day? And what is the reason why, for me in this scenario, I am going all in in real estate? So kind of jumping right into it, I want to be financially free by 40. I want to not have, uh, I want to have the option not to work once I retire at 40 and just make money when I sleep. I want my real estate properties that passive income coming every month to where it covers all expenses, potential vacations, um, and anything I want to do uh, with my family. Um, and not just my family that um, you know, we'll be expanding on, you know, relatively soon, but on future generations, okay, I, I want to create generational wealth uh, for my family. And, you know, how do I do that? Um, basically, you're, you're putting in the work now, so you can kind of have fun later, okay? So you're getting educated on the different free resources online. You're calling people that you need to call. You're asking a whole lot of questions, and I'm pretty much trying to do that while working a full-time job for the military, and I'm having a ball doing it. Um, I was very fortunate enough to be stationed in Germany from a first duty station for three years as a nurse out there, and I was lucky enough to see about 26 different countries traveling all over the place with uh, with my buddies over there, and I got to see a different different part of the world and a different way of life, and um, I loved it out there, you know. And I want to get to a point where, at any given time, I can just get up, leave, take the family, and we can go to go to Spain for a month, or you know, go on a a travel to South America, you know, for for a couple of weeks, and have it completely paid for through real estate. Um, and that's pretty much a an end goal uh, for me and you know my team that I'm trying to build. Um, lastly, before I go, it's kind of a quick video um, on BiggerPockets.com where we talked about uh, the podcast not too long ago. Brandon Turner is one of the main hosts of that podcast, and you know he mentioned multiple times that when his daughter was born, he had bought a fourplex. And the goal for him was instead of, um, you know, taking out multiple financing in order to pay for, you know, these high costs of college, he bought a fourplex. And through that passive income and the appreciation of the property, uh, over the course of 18 years, he'd be paying off the house and uh, his daughter would be exposed to um, real estate throughout her uh, childhood and going into uh, adulthood. And that's pretty much what, you know, it is starting to shoot light bulbs off my head because you know, the whole time I'm thinking, you know, being in the military, oh, I'm just going to save the GI Bill for my kids and I want real estate to be almost like a, a backup plan or, you know, the number one plan, you know, for, for me and my uh, future kids, you know what I mean? So I had the GI Bill available and use real estate as a way to fund college. That way, you know, kids aren't coming out with a hundred grand in debt, etc. and, you know, trying to make it by for... 10, 15 years before they even can enjoy life. Um, so in a nutshell, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to be able to get to a point where I can do what I want, when I want with my family. And uh, pretty much I'm, I'm trying to gain as much time as I can with my, my family moving forward through real estate. So it's going to be a fun, fast, um, busy next uh, probably five, 10 years in real estate, you know, trying to uh, make these deals. And but I'm looking forward to it. And I hope you guys are uh, along with me for the ride. And I look forward to hearing from you. All right. Have a good day.